Hi, I'm Wai Hong and he's Henry. We are from SMJK Changwa. As you all see, Henry is a person who loves sleeping all the time. Now is the time to make the video, but he's still sleeping. Henry, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wow. Now is the time to make the video. You know? Oh, I am Henry. And why are you keep saying rocket when you are sitting? Oh, because today in science lesson we learn about rocket. Can you demonstrate the process of the rocket flying to me? Sure, let me show you. Okay. Okay, now I want you to hold this. Okay. Now. Okay. This is a balloon. Okay. I want you to blow it. Put these edges together, they won't let go. Hold still. Okay, now, when you stay there, I'm gonna pull this straight. So, what happens next is when you let go of the balloon, you will fly from that end to this end of the string. Okay? One, two, three, start. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna tell you how it works. Okay. okay. So what happens now is when I blow the balloon, the balloon is filled with air. When I let go of it, air rushes out. So when air rushes out, it creates a forward motion called thrust. Okay. Therefore, it will allow this balloon to fly from this end to this other end. And all this has to do with the rocket is because they use the same science concept, Newton's third law, the law of motion. For every action, there is an opposite and equal reaction. Okay? Get it? Yes. That's my boy. Wait. Push. Let's go and find him. Okay. Oh, oh, there it is. It's in a bowl of water. Now let me test your intelligence. What floats on the water? Uh, the boat? A boat. Okay. I'm going to ask you another question. Okay. How can you move a boat on the water without moving your hands? Let me demonstrate the experiment. Okay. okay. First, please help me to take away the battery. Okay. And can you get me some dishwash soap? Okay, hold on. I'm back. Okay. First, uh, give me the... How many to this? Okay. Uh, dip the stick into the dishwash soap. Alright. Okay. And the small triangle, put some... Soap on it, right? And put it here, and it will. Wow! How did you do it? First, we have pushed some dishwash soap on the small triangle behind the small boat, and the dishwash soap is a surfactant. So when it makes contact with the water, it will break down the surface tension of the water. At the same time, it will produce a slightly force of movement which will push the bubbles across the water. Oh, so that's how it works. Yes. Uh. Okay, now I'm going to throw the water away. Wait, 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 wait. Don't waste water. What? Well, actually you can use this water to do another experiment. Okay. Do you want me to show you? Okay. Alright, let me get this my... This is my miniature water fountain. Okay. Okay, now what I want you to do is I want you to hold this bottle while I pour the water in the bowl to this bottle. Okay. Alright, pour yeah, nice and slow, nice and slow. Okay, stop. 
Okay. Now, I want you to blow another balloon for me. Okay. Alright. Yep. That's big. Now, can you give me a hand and place the balloon on the top of the bottle? Alright, so now you've helped me to place the balloon on the on the on top of the bottle. Okay. Now when I let go, water will flow out from this straw. Right? Okay. Do you see the magic? Yes. In the count of three, two, two one. one. Amazing, isn't it? Yes. Now I will explain the process. So when the bottle was actually filled with air particles and the water molecules. So when I place the balloon filled with air, all the air particles in the balloon will rush into the bottle, thus pushing the water molecules out of the bottle through this straw, which will make into a water fountain. So Wai Hong, do you understand? Where is Wai Hong? Hey, I remember he was here. Oh, surprise! What's that? It's a duck flute, you know? A duck flute made from straw. Yes. So, how do you make a voice from just a simple straw? It's not a simple straw, you know? Oh. It is cut into a small triangle. Can you see the small triangle here? Yeah. When the straw is blown, uh, the small triangle here it will force the two pieces of the point here to vibrate uh -huh. very fast against each other. Oh. Therefore, it can produce a dark light sound. So that's how you make your prank? Yes. Thanks for watching our video. Please enjoy our video. Thank you.